Okay, so we've got a question here that um, looks at uh, making t the subject of the formula. So that means our answer line will need t equals. So when we're doing making something the subject, remember that means rearranging to leave t on its own and positive. Um, so we just want one of them. At the moment we've got three t's here, also we've got a plus 11, and it's all equal to w. So t is already positive, so we're going to leave it on its own there. So that means we've got the 11 and the 3 to move to the left-hand side of the equals. And we always move things, remember, by doing the opposite operations. Um, always deal with terms that are uh, not involved in the subject letter first. Unless there's a root, then uh, possibly you've got to deal with the root first. Um, so here we're going to take away 11 first. And remember, it's a top-down process. So we started with W on the left-hand side of the equals. So we've now got W take away 11 and that is equal to 3t because the 11 take away 11 has made 0 so that 11 has disappeared from the right hand side it's uh, transferred over to the left hand side of the equals um, we want to know what 1t is so we're going to have to divide by 3 um, because that's 3 times t uh, the opposite of times in dividing so 3 divided by 3 is 1 so we've got 1t and we've got w take away 11 because remember we come top down so that was w take away 11 first and then we're dividing all of that by 3 uh, because um, the equals um, is between t and the left hand side here, they're interchangeable so we can just swap those two over to make t equals w take 11 over 3. Okay, so that's uh, making t the subject of a formula.